So, Chief, can you tell us what you're doing out here today on the river? Oh, well, we're working very hard cataloging all of the moorings that are out here. There are some people that are not in compliance. There are some people that are in violation. But in addition to that, we want to create a, a, a permanent log of their latitude and longitude and exactly where each mooring is so that we can revisit them should the mooring need to be moved or if they lose their chain due to uh, corrosion or whatnot. So that's what we're doing today. It's, it's quite a task. There's a lot of work involved. It seems like quite a task. How many moorings does the town have? The town has just under 300 moorings total and they're, they're spread out in a variety of areas. And it would seem that to organize the mooring fields in this way is probably in the best interest of everybody, right? It certainly is, and we've had a lot of um, citizens that, that have the uh, moorings, and essentially if they lose their chain, which happens out here during the winter or, or inclement weather and so forth, that um, it's very difficult. If they don't have that, we resort to either what the mooring um, service company that, that put the mooring in, but this way we're going to have an exact location of where every mooring is so that we can revisit that down the road. And every mooring will have been charted using a GPS and will be as part of a database and also it will be a hard copy that you guys can work off of at any time. That's correct and that's what we're really uh, we're striving for right now and it's time consuming, it's labor intensive, but when we get through with this, this is just going to be wonderful. It's been a while since we have done this and we're finding that there, again, there are a lot of people that are not in compliance and that are also in violation we found illegal moorings, unmarked moorings, and again, we don't, by all stretch, we do not want to be hauling these moorings and inconveniencing the public, but if they're unmarked and we don't know whose they are, we look at it that they could be illegal moorings and we will haul them.